Welcome. Here is a rundown of war in Ukraine. Is this the heaviest wave of missile strikes yet? Ukraine has today faced another intense wave of Russian bombardment, killing at least one person. Power outages have been noted across the country, with half of those in the capital of Kiev without electricity and power lines down. Ukraine claims tonight has seen the heaviest wave of missile strikes on infrastructure in nearly nine months of war, with upwards of 100 rockets launched. Strikes have rained down on Kiev, Lviv and Rivna in the west, Kharkiv in the northeast, and Poltava, Odessa and Mykolaiv in the south and Zydomir in the north. The situation has been described as critical by Ukrainian officials, while Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky earlier warned it may not be over. This is the most massive shelling of the power system since the beginning of the war, Energy Minister Herman Halashchenko said. Crisis situation as Russian missiles land in Poland, killing two U.S. intelligence. Russian missiles tonight crossed into Poland and killed two people, a senior U.S. intelligence official has claimed. An explosion reportedly took place in Przewado, a village in eastern Poland near to the border with Ukraine. Firefighters at the scene said it is unclear what happened. However, Polish radio ZET reported that two stray missiles hit the village. Polish government spokesman Piotr Mueller did not immediately confirm the information, but said top leaders were holding an emergency meeting due to a crisis situation. Moscow has launched a raft of missiles upwards of 100 at Ukraine today, knocking out power for 7 million households. It is unclear whether these missiles were part of the same wave, but it is the first time Russian rockets have reportedly landed in Poland. And NATO looking into reports of Poland blast. We've now had a comment from a NATO official on allegations a Russian missile struck a village in Poland this evening. It said, we are looking into these reports linked to a blast in Poland and closely coordinating with our ally Poland. All eyes are on NATO at the moment, after it repeatedly claimed it would protect every inch of its territory from Russian aggression in Europe. Russia has denied the alleged strike. Thank you.